Now that you have completed the lesson, The Elements of Fiction, you will now use the software Storybird to create your own narrative fiction. That is, you will tell a story. The first thing you need to do is to follow the Storybird link to create yourself an account. Before that, I'm going to copy this access code because I will need it in order to join the class. Once I have copied that, I will follow the Storybird link to create an account. Ensure you're creating a student account, as this is the only way you will be able to access the assignment. Give yourself a username. In this case, we will just use Sample Janelle. Email is optional. If you'd like to include it, you may, but it's by no means necessary. A password, make sure it's something you will remember, as I cannot recover this for you. Once you have chosen your username and password, simply click Create Account. Uploading an avatar picture is optional again. You may choose to upload an image if you would like, or you can skip this step. Here's where it will prompt you for a class code. This is the one that we copied a moment ago. And then I will click Join Class. Once I'm here, I can see the assignment, Creative Narrative Fiction Storybird. This is the one I'm going to need to do, so I will click on the assignment. It gives you the description of this assignment. Now here's the fun part about Storybird. They provide artwork by many, many professional artists. Your job is to choose art that will support the story you'd like to tell. One thing I often look for is repetitive characters. Avoid clicking use this art until you are ready to go or it will create a new book every time. Instead, I'll click view all and this will show me all of the art by this particular artist. What I'm looking for is the recurrence of characters as if I'm going to tell a story about a character, I need several images. Here I could maybe tell a story about a monster or a group of monsters, but there doesn't seem to be a lot of characters recurring. So I will go back and look for other artists. This might be the most time consuming part of this assignment as it will take a while to find an artist who has enough art with a similar theme. Assuming Anthony Jegu does have enough art, I would just click use this art for a multi-page picture book. Now it's a matter of dragging and dropping. I drag and then I write my story here. That's, that's really all there is to Storybird. 